Good morning, everyone. Say good morning. Good morning, everyone. Welcome to Fridays on 42nd Street. I'm Katie Merriman, and I'm here with Jack at the Playhouse. Um, we wanted to say a hello to you. We wanted to give you a little update about Don't Let the Pigeon Drive the Bus. Speaking of which, Jack, did you see Don't Let the Pigeon Drive the Bus? Yeah, I liked it so much. I saw it three times. Oh, oh you saw it three times? Yeah. What's your favorite part? Um, when the bus driver said that music to my ear, then he sings his song. Oh, that is so good. You're right. One of my favorite parts is when the bus driver's mom comes out and she says, I like that part. You say, what does she say? I love you, baby boo boo. So good. So we hope you can all come and see it. We know um, that there is some weather going on. Jack is here because he doesn't have school today. I'm sure many of you don't. Um, and we are going to announce by 11 o'clock this morning what our plan for the weather is. So hold on a second. If you have tickets for the show tonight, just um, we will post it on our website. We'll post it on social media around 11 o'clock this morning and let you know. If we do cancel tonight and you have tickets for this evening's performance, you will get an email from us. It will tell you what your options are. Um, and we will make sure that if you want to come back and see a different performance, that you can come back and see it. Because as Jack has told us, it is a very fun show that I hope you can all come see. My, um, my class is Emma Oh, really? Yeah. Did you talk to your teacher about that? Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, uh, the other thing we wanted to check uh, in about is that in addition to the weather announcement for tonight, on Monday our the playoffs will be closed to observe MLK Day. It's also a day of service, so if any of you have places out in the community that you can find to volunteer on your time off, I know some of our staff, like Leanne, already have their service plans. Um, we will not have volunteers in our building to observe that day, um, but there are plenty of other places where we can serve on that day. Um, also, coming up on January 24th are auditions for Singing in the Rain. So, just to clarify, Singing in the Rain is a remounted production that we had to close because of COVID two years ago now. Um, Aaron Horst is coming back to direct and choreograph. We are putting on that same show in many ways, but it will be different because some of our cast will be different. Um, everyone in the cast was given the option to return to their role, and obviously things have changed for the last two years. So some of them are not able to come back, some of them are. Um, we have tons of parts open in the show, and we need people to audition for it, especially if you like singing and dancing um, uh, and tapping. Uh, there are lots of speaking roles still available, lots of singing and dancing ensemble roles available. So go to dmplayoffs.com slash audition and you can check out uh, online what is open to you, and I believe you can already sign up today if you would like to audition for Singing in the Rain on the 24th. I so do. So look ahead to that. Jack, you want to audition? Yeah. Can you tap dance? We are looking for two yeah. young people uh, yeah, roles yeah. in the show. Yeah, that's good. So if I you are a young dance. male identifying person I, or would I, like to play I, that kind of a character, me. there is a little duet for two young people in the show. So I even can. a couple opportunities for kids. I can do both of those things. Okay, great. Well, you can sign up for an audition if you like. Um, that's all we have today. Again, look for the announcement for tonight around 11 o'clock on social media. You'll get emailed if you have a ticket for this evening. For all of you who are home with your children today, um, God bless. And we're thinking of you. And uh, we will see you all next week.